Hello everybody and welcome back to Star Wars Knights of the Old Republic. Trying to say that fast is not a good idea. Anyway, we've just met Joe Lee and in order to be our friend, we have to do some stuff for him as per the usual rules of friendship in a game. So, we're gonna do that. <laughs> um, shoot. Fine, old man. I can't go into your little, your little hut? Okay. Broken droid. Okay. I'll see the camel? Oh, boy. Uh, okay, I will save. Should I try to, um... Oh, I can just scrap it? I can scrap it? Uh... Can I try to repair it, or no? I don't see anything about repairing. Bye. You back away. The droid appears to suffer some sort of additional interior trauma. I'm sorry! What? Journal? What? Whoa, what? What? Whoa! Whoa! You can play this game in first person? Whoa. No, you can't. But you can look at somebody in the first person. I hit caps lock on accident, and that's what happened. Use your sense of judgment? Okay. I'll stop. Hang on, let's see. I guess I'll just scrap him. Oh, shutting down! He shut down! You start with the droid's head, removing it and placing it in your pack, and energy discharge flows to the remaining part. Oh my gosh, it blew up! What? That was a bad idea! That was a bad idea! My sense of judgment is impaired! Why didn't you tell me about that, you dang that man over there? Man! On his debt. Okay, mm-hmm. They were identified, they were ambushed, but identified that guy's Eli. <gasps> That's right! He, I knew he recognized the name. The merchant you met on the docking ring, it appears that he talked the truth about those creditors that supposedly skipped out on paying him. You have salvaged the droid's head. Matten would likely be very interested in it. Oh, <laughs> Uh, the Wicked Chief didn't take any Brother Zalbar. No, I'm not gonna kill the Wicked. But I am gonna save. We did it. I have loads of sense. It's just squirrel sense? Yeah. All that for a droid head. I mean, I guess if it gives me credits. <laughs> credits. Jolie's hat. Okay, well, hmm. Eeny, man. Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. Catch a tiger by the toe. If you all are little baby, you do it every day. I don't care. We're going straight. What am I doing? Aha, take that. <laughs> Whoa, I keep turning the camera. We are doing so much better with Candorous. I mean, I might anybody playing a game like this is gonna pick up what they can. Why go straight when you can go both ways? Hey, let me see. It's your girl. <laughs> Ow. She died. Done. Wow, we are owning. Like, look at how much. 
much we are owning. Okay, the story in this game is right now, there's somebody called Revan and Malik. These two people, um, they're, they're very evil. Um, and they have, they attacked us. They're trying to kill, they tried to kill Bastila. So, so the Sith are trying to rise up, essentially, um, and fight. It's basically a giant war going on between the Jedi and the Sith again. And it's just 3,000 years in the past, and we were on the ship that Bastila was on that got attacked, because Bastila has a unique ability in the Force that lets her do, like, a battle command thing. She can control uh, an entire force, or she can um, help an entire force be more like a... Uh, um, fight together more as a unit, I guess. And so now, but we found out that I have Jedi powers, and I got trained a little bit, and we're trying to figure out what caused Revan and Malak, because they used to be Jedi. We're trying to figure out what caused Revan and Malak to change into being so evil, and we're trying to stop them from tearing apart the Empire, or the, uh, the Republic, rather. Kai is lurking. The aim is to kill things with a lightsaber. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, Revan's gone. Malak is the Dark Lord now. Okay. Okay, no, no. They're just, they're just bad guys. They're just bad guys. You know? Uh, Lemon Z. So. They're, they're the, they're the, they're the driving force behind the Sith attacks right now. <laughs> And they, something corrupted them, though, is the problem. Like, on the Jedi homeworld where we got trained, uh, we found out that something had corrupted Revan and Malak. And so we, we, we're, we're now, we're trying to get, there's a Starforge thing that was what the ancient Sith used to, like, or no, or no an, ancient, an ancient species, an ancient alien species used to, like, create these, these, really amazing things and weapons and stuff like that. And, but the Star Forge can be used to create, like, an army, essentially. And so we're trying to find the maps to the Star Forge. Like, we're, we're finding bits and pieces of the map to the Star Forge. Oh, I can level up. So we can try to beat them to it or find it where they, wherever they hit it. You want to see me play Wasteland 2? I think I've heard of that. I want to up my persuade. Yep, yep. Okay. Beat. Oh boy, what do I want? Adds a plus two damage bonus with lightsabers. Plus three bonus to all blaster bolt deflection rolls. Certain items may apply bonus or penalty to this ability. Okay. That's cool, actually. Adds a plus one attack to melee. Oh, that's a really good one, too. <gasps> plus two bonus to persuade, awareness, and treat injury. Okay, add feet. Nice. Ooh, I get more powers. Ooh. Power, jet power unleashes an energy attack on all hostile creatures up to 16 meters directly in front of the Jedi. Victims suffer 1 to 6 points of damage per each attacking character level to a maximum of 10 levels. Wow. A successful will save by the targets. Uh, they will get half the, yeah, half the damage. Um... The dogs, ooh, yikes, yeah. An opponent targeted by this power is pushed back five meters, thrown to the ground, and stunned for three seconds, and suffers damage equal to the attacking character's level. Successful reflex save by the target at a DC of five, plus the attacking character's level, plus the attacking character's wisdom and charisma modifiers. Hey, it means the target is not stunned, but I have a really high charisma, so ha 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 ha. I think. Okay. What's this one do? Okay, let's look at some of the nice powers. 
Hmm. The Jedi is temporarily granted plus two bonus to defense. Boring. The power allows a Jedi to move very swiftly. That's pretty cool. This power increases the physical attributes and saving throws of all Jedi and party members by two points. Points. Okay. Power of shields. Boring. Okay, so all the cool stuff are in the, uh, the dark side powers. Effect mine enables precise use of the force. Once a Jedi has this power, extra options will appear in the conversation as appropriate. Success is not guaranteed for extreme commands or the target is not strong, or the target is strong-willed. This power does not affect droids. Only the main player character can select this power during level up. Interesting. That's a dark side. That's a dark side power. Nice power. It is a nice playthrough. But it is. I don't, there's not a lot of cool ones though. I mean, this, this speedy one's pretty cool. The rest of these, the, all the light side powers are defensive. And I can't get that yet. Bastila has stun. I could get stun droid. Wound. This trigger spasms in the victim's lungs, causing great pain and inflicting two thirds of the attacking character's level and damage every two seconds. Yeah, and a successful fortitude save. Blah, blah, blah. Okay. Slow. This power clouds the mind, making a target's actions unusually sluggish. The victim suffers a minus two penalty to defense. Reflex. Save and attack rolls. The effect lasts for 30, se 30 seconds. Blah, 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 blah. What's this do? Whoa, this power causes a hostile creature within a five meter radius to target to cower in the catatonic fear of the attacking Jedi for 12 seconds. The successful will save. Yeah, 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 yeah. Wow. Coder 2 throws out all the rules. You discover what? The description for the lightning doesn't say unlimited power. Upgrade lightning. There are neutral powers. Upgrade lightning. Okay. I'll, the upgraded lightning does look pretty amazing. So. I do like the horror one, though. That looks cool. Oh, wait. Uh, oh, yes. I do have a very high charisma. <laughs> I have a high charisma, strength, and constitution and wisdom. Perfect. Perfect. I have excellent stats. Excellent, excellent. And then save. Pshoom. Okay, was it? So we've explored all this whole area. Time to go back this way. I love getting the Jedi powers. This is pretty fun. <gasps> Let's use our force lightning. Our upgraded force lightning. It did. Oh, it did a lot of damage. My bad. I thought it was the healing, but that was not. That was not it. Oh man, we're just owning. We're owning everybody. Nothing. Oh wait. Oh, then that way. Now we go this way. Wookie corpse. Everything else is not but a Wookie Wookie corpse apparently. Oh man! Rip, rip cheer. Thank you, Kai, for the five minutes. My dude, I appreciate that ad you watched on my behalf. Thank you so much. Uh, Fallout 3, a must-see for, uh, for me to stream. I, did I, no, I started New Vegas a long time ago. And my friend played some Fallout 3 that I, oh, a slaver contract, a bow caster, and a bow caster bolt casting. What, what did, show me. Show me the journal entry. You have found the corpse of a missing Wookiee. This is Roar? No! <gasps> a data patch show revealed that he dealt with slavers, was on his body, as well as a bowcaster bolt casing that probably belongs to whoever killed him. Roar! Oh my gosh! He was actually helping the slavers, and somebody found out and killed him. 
So now I have to go back to all those people who were missing him and, like, try to tell them that he was actually not a great guy. Okay, cool. That's going to go over really well. What is my my TBP list? No, Caillou, thank you. No, don't you don't don't need to cheer bits. Uh I don't think I I can read the data pad. I read the the journal entry. What's in my to be played list? It there's a lot. I really don't even know anymore. Um, other one, two, uh, whoa. All the games that, you know, Within My Fires has gotten me. Maybe I can try to recover this one. Uh, I don't think that worked. Uh, I don't think I'm super good at recovering mines. Mission's good at that. Are you guys gonna? Is this your guys' camp? Oh no, I'm supposed to talk you guys out of being here. Who are you another civil merchant like that coral slime up on the docking ring? This is my territory. I don't make deals, and I don't persuade easily, so go back topside. Mess with my profits, and I'll see You don't you persuade get. easily, huh? Shoot, I should be wearing my other thing, which I think gives me a persuade bonus. However, I just upgraded my persuade abilities. Why do we have compies attacking? I don't know. What all do I need to play? I'd like to finish Deus Ex that I played forever ago. I want to finish Soma. I want to finish Transistor. Hi, puppy boy. What? Mm, it, uh, Chundar has given me permission to be here? He's got no authority but me. I'm with Zerka Corporation. He's just some pet we keep to the local stand. Ha -ha. As long as you don't get in my way, you can wander where you want. Um, what if I want you to leave the Shadowlands? Yeah, is that old hermit Jolie trying to talk you into doing his dirty work? We've spent too much on setting up just a As long as the sonic emitters keep the Preds away and we've got bodies to guard the perimeter, we're staying right here. I mean, if I can put up with my own worthless guards complaining about this place, Jolie whining through you is nothing. If you made it this far, you know a fair bit already. What would I be able to tell you? Are you part of the slating operation? What? No, I don't do much of that. It's too much of a headache. I'm in the business of harvesting animals. Some of the more exotic species have organs that can be removed and put to some surprising applications. Talk to me about work and maybe I'll tell you. <gasps> no. Uh, back to my question about the shadow. If you made it uh, look at tyranny. I don't think I've ever heard of it. A smolter? Ah, <laughs> uh, a small raptor. Like a super small. A super small raptor. Uh, is there anything odd down here? I'm a human! Predators that can kill in seconds? I suppose there's old Bindo. He's got a camp here somewhere. I'd leave him alone, though. Anyone who'd lived down here was just plain You mean Jolie? We've got a repulsive field to the east, so not much passes through here. Okay, okay. I know what I have to do. Hang on, let's see. I have to go put down that field. If the Shadowlands are so dangerous, how do you... I have to put down the field and try to, like, draw in predators to kill them, maybe? It ain't easy. We've set up a perimeter of sonic emitters to keep the bigger preds away. It's worked so far. As long as the emitters are operational, we're pretty much safe. I love that he's telling some random person down here, like, this. Like, oh yeah, like three different times he's told me, like, the only way his camp remains safe is through these sonic emitters. I'm like, okay, bye! 
not down here to direct crime. Tyranny has four endings depending on the choices you make. Nice! Alright, that sounds like my kind of game. Can't wait for your competition money to go through? Yeah, that'll be great, honestly. I gotta do my I gotta do my tax return. Just tell me! Just tell me our major weakness. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's fine. Just, uh, it's fine. To the east, you said. Forsooth. Are we gonna do it? My skill is too low to recover it. Uh, what about you? I don't know if your skill's high enough. I can't even see it. What can I do? Yeah, okay. Uh, this is all about me, apparently. I'm here. Disable it, then. It's not like images, you say? I'll try this one. Nope, okay. It should blow up on me if I try to, like, undo it. And then does it work? I feel like it should blow up on me. Alright, cool. To the east! I don't- those were not the sonic emitters. These creatures, I would murder the- uh, murder them all if I thought it would actually make the noises go away. Oh, I should- I should shave. Mm, sonic emitters. Oh. Try to recover it. Sonic! Sonic emitters! Pie jacks! They definitely remind me of pie jacks. A hundred percent. I don't know. I thought I actually said that earlier, but I don't think I did. I think I just thought I. But yes, they are verily pie jacks. Like, it's literally, they're literally pie jacks. Shimmer of repulsor field is visible before you. It stands in stark contrast with the contrast with the foliage around it. This is obviously one of the barriers to your progress that Jolie was speaking of. If he were here, he would allow you to pass it. Okay, well, where is the sonic? Did I actually take out all the sonic emitters? Is that what I did? I thought they were like frag mines and stuff. Uh, I know, right? But I mean, it's a bioware game. Yeah, well, the monkey things are called tax or something. Sahara on bed. Oh my gosh, lemon seed, that would be perfect! Sahara is gonna have fantasy pie jacks. I don't know what else to do. Should I just chase you guys into there, maybe? Chase them in? Or is it these? Oh! Don't mind me. Okay. They're just gonna let me? They're just gonna let me walk up to the Sonic interfaces? Hang on. They're just gonna... Wait, and I'm still going. There we go. No, come on. Okay. They're just letting me walk up and turn them off! Who's the little 
girl, what? No, I'm turning them off. Like, they've stopped moving. Like, oh, hang on. I gotta wait for a second. But they've stopped moving. I'm just, well, well, I don't know. Alternate access options, no other options available. Okay. Um, I don't know. Motion detecting goggles, repair kit, advanced med kit. Nice. The background music is annoying currently. Okay, hang on. I'm gonna try to break it. Tat gland, disruptor rifle, concussion grenade, light repeater blasters. Oh, the generator! Oh, that's a that's a slave cage. Where's the generator for these things? I mean, could I break it? I don't know. I don't I'm stuck now. I don't know what to do. It said go east and I went east as far as I could. Yes. Oh no. What? Um, is there a like a, a a button that I can hit that lets me look around and look at the things that are selectable? Like uh, well, like normally it would be like tab or something. Ow! I don't, do I not have a high enough skill to hack this? Like, I don't see a generator, I don't see, I, I don't think I can pickpocket this guy for, like, a key code. Well, yeah, but, like, I don't know how to get the key code off of him. Unless I get, like, each guard. If you want anything, you'll have to talk to the command. Uh, I'd rather ask about you. I guess I could ask, okay, yeah, I guess I could talk to the other soldiers. Okay, cool, all right. Oh wait! The told me to and the soldiers, the soldiers don't want to be here. Why couldn't they have just equipped this lump of tech with a blaster and left me at home? I want to ask you some questions. I'm not here because I know stuff. I handle a blaster well enough to guard this emitter, and that's it. Talk to the commander. This is a dangerous place. Can I persuade you to leave? No more dangerous than walking out on the commander. He'd kill me for disobeying. Other questions. I'm not here because what do these emitters do? They generate a sonic barrier that allows us to stay in this wonderful location. I don't know how it works, really. I just okay. So the emitters are the only thing keeping you here. What of it? So if someone shut them down, you could leave. I yes. Yeah, that's for sure. I suppose you could take this code and shut down the emitter. I'm wow. Sure. Enough of those emitters go down. And Camp will have to move out, but I never Oh my that. gosh. They really don't want to be here. And they're willing to get their camp overrun. Okay. They're willing to get their camp overrun. You want any 
thing you'll have to talk Okay, what you doing what here? Yep, uh, I'm a guy with the emitter. Let's uh, talk about this what emitter. Do you want to know about that? It's just one of five or so sonic Yep! The and the boss is right there! I don't like I did it! Enough of those emitters go down in the camp. Yep, okay! You guys are great! Your, your boss has no idea what I'm doing, apparently, and I'm right here. Primary function, guard code. Yay. This was very dumb. That was very dumb of those guards to let me do this. Also, apparently, I'm okay to just stand here. We're just, Kendra's just turned around like, well, that was dumb. <laughs> Uh, take this card and shut this down so I can have go have a couple beers. Uh, no, it was two guards. We did it. We did it. Anything else to do in here? Nope. Okay, well, we did that thing. We did what we were supposed to. Well, it took me longer than I would have liked to realize that in order to get past this little section, I had to talk to people. Crazy in an RPG that you have to talk to the other NPCs. Uh, but we figured it out in the end, so thank you all for, uh, f putting up with that for me, with me, I don't know, words, anyway, thank you all again for watching, and I hope to see you in the next one.